Hi everyone, thank you for being here. So today we're going to do a very modified uh, practice. So we're going to do the practice down here on the floor. Okay? So if you have any pain, any injuries in uh, your hips, in your knees, in your ankles, you can just try this practice here. And uh, so let's uh, come up and we start with our um, uh, chant. So I would say that you come up on your knees and you are a little back on your mat. Okay? Now you want to bring your knees open as your hips so you make space in between your knees. And you bring your hands in front of your heart, palms together, and we do the chant. Vande Gurunam Charanara Vinde Sandara Shita Swat Masukava Bode Nishreya Se Jangalika Yamane Sansara Hala Hala Mohajanthe Abahu Purushakaram Shenga Chakra Siddharinam Sashra Shirasam Shwetam Pranamami Patanjalim Bring your hands by your side. We start the Surya Namaskar A, so we modify that as well. So let's do it together. Bring your hands by your side, engage with your belly, engage with your bandhas, and breathe in and out, engage with your Ujjayi breath. So let's start with the first movement. So A, come inhale, bring your arms up, look to your thumbs, press your hands together. Do it, exhale. Now go down in a tabletop position and arch your spine up. Look towards the navel. Now inhale, three knee. Lower your belly down. Look up. Make space in your spine. Tailbone up. Okay. So now bring your hands a little forward. Chatwari. Exhale. Lower down completely on the floor. Now engage your legs. Engage your bandhas. Inhale. Lift your chest. Only the chest. Engage the muscles in the spine. Shut. Exhale. Go back either in chai pose or in a half puppy pose. Half down dog. So you bring your hands forward and you place your head on the floor. Now, if you are staying here, you can either tug your toes under and make sure that your hips are in line, just stuck above your knees. Engage your shoulders and breathe. One. Now, remember your dress, you wanna to look towards the navel, draw your belly in, two. Three, strong arms, press your hands on the floor, four. And uh, five. Now, inhale, bring your hands back. Come up in a tabletop position. Drop your belly down. Tailbone up, head up. Good. Now, exhale again. Arch your spine. Look towards the navel. Okay? Now, now by inhale, untag your toes under. Lift up your arms and your chest. Press your hands together. Look to the thumbs. And exhale. Samasthiti here. Let's do it again. They come inhale up. Do exhale, tabletop, arch your spine, look to the navel. Three inhale, drop your belly down, tailbone up, head up. Bring your hands forward, chatwari, exhale, lower down slowly with your muscles. Inhale, lift your chest, engage your legs. And exhale back either in half down dog or child pose. If you are both position, bring your head on the floor and breathe. One, two, three. 
Now, even if you are in child pose, remember, engage your arms. Four. Rotate your shoulders, roll in. And five, sata. Inhale, come up. And again, drop your belly down, tables up, and head up. Okay? Exhale, arch to arch your spine. Press your hands, look to the navel. Nava, inhale, come up. And exhale, samasthita here. Good, let's do it three more times. So you come inhale up, do it, exhale down, arch your spine, look to the navel. Three, inhale, head up. And chatwari, exhale. Now, draw your belly in slowly, elbow down. Pancha, inhale, lift. And shut, exhale. Again, take your puppy pose or your child pose. One, two, keep breathing, draw your belly in. Three, four, and five. Sapta, inhale, come up, drop your belly down, look up. Ashto, exhale, arch your spine, look to the navel. Nava, inhale, and we up. Rotate your shoulders, exhale, samasthita. Good, two more. Come, inhale, up. Do it, exhale, arch your spine. Three, inhale, head up. And shot one, exhale, slowly lower down. Pancha, inhale, lift, engage the muscles in your back, elbows on your side. Lift up. Exhale, shut back. Half down dog or child pose. One. Two. Three. Four. And five. Sapta, inhale, drop your belly down. Ashto, exhale, arch your spine, low to the navel. Nava, inhale, all the way up. Samasthiti, exhale. Good, last one. I come inhale, up. Do exhale, down, arch your spine. Three, inhale. And shot one, exhale, elbows on your side, lower down, punch, inhale, lift your chest, shut, exhale, back, and now breathe five times, one, two, strong, over your legs, your arms, and get your banda, three, Four and five. Sapta, inhale, drop your belly down, head up. Ashto, exhale, arch. Nava, inhale, all the way up. Exhale, samasthita. Good, now let's go down on the floor because we're gonna start the uh, usual standing position. So now we start the standing position uh, down on the floor with the legs crossed, okay? So we start with the trikonasana. Now bring your arms by your side, externally rotate your shoulders and exhale, fold, flex to the side. Bring your hand, your right one down on the floor and now your left one up. And breathe. One. Now, as we're doing trikonasana, draw your belly in. Press your left sitting bones on the ground. Look up to the fingers. Three. Open your chest. Four. Keep engaging your legs. And five. Three. Inhale. Come up. And shot one. Exhale. Opposite side. Look up to your hand. One. Now, remember, keep rotating your shoulders. Two. Draw your belly in, keep reaching up, four, and five, punch, inhale, come up, now rotation of the spine, so rotate, place your hand over your knee, the other one back, now inhale again, chest up and exhale, rotate back, 
five breaths, one. Now remember, keep rotating with your spine, so press your hips on the ground, two. Keep engaging your bandas, three, four, and five. Three, and inhale, come up, open your arms, Chotwadi, exhale, turn to the opposite side. So right hand over your left knee, the other one back and keep twisting and rotating. Now, bring your spine up, make space. One, keep resting your sitting bones on the ground. Two, three, keep on getting your legs and your bandas. Four, and five. Inhale, pancha come up, arms reach the opposite way. Exhale, samastiti, hands on the ground. Good, let's do Tita Pajvakanasana. So we come inhale, open your arms again, do exhale. Now we're gonna do the same. So lean over the side. Now, if it's comfortable, bring your knee, your elbow down on the floor. Reach forward with your left hand. Now look up, keep twisting your body to the side and look up. One. Two, keep breathing, open your chest, Roman in, three, keep pressing your left sitting bones on the ground. Now, this uh, shoulder here, away from your ear, don't sink down, okay? Open up, four, keep twisting, and five, three, knee, inhale, up, and chatwari, exhale, opposite side. So, move on the side, now bend your elbow down, and swing your right arm up. Now keep rotating your shoulders, look up and breathe. One. Now make sure that your right hip is on the ground. Two, three, the breath with sound. Four, keep breathing, draw it in. And five, punch and inhale, come up. Now rotation, we're gonna do exactly the same. So exhale, do it down. Now make space in your body and exhale again back. One, two, keep twisting, pressing your hips on the ground, draw your belly in, three, four, And a five, three, inhale, come up, opposite way with your hands, Chotwari, exhale, down, inhale again, and exhale, keep twisting, one, two, three, keep your legs strong, engage your bandas, four, And a five, a punch, a inhale, up, open, reach opposite way, and exhale, samasthiti. Good, now let's do um, um, Prasarita Padottanasana, okay? So now I would say the Prasarita Padottanasana, we're gonna open the legs to the side. So open the legs as much as you can, it's fine, as long as you keep your toes up, okay? Don't um, point your feet and try to feel that your legs are straight, strong, toes pointing up, okay? So you come inhale, open your arms. Now do it, exhale, bring the hands forward. Inhale again, open your chest, bring your chest forward. Now you can either sit there or three knee exhale, fold whatever you can, even bringing the elbows on the ground, okay? Or you can even go farther than that. Now remember, we are not compromising the toes, they are not coming inside, so keep rotating your legs, and say whatever you can. Breathe. One, two, now keep bringing your sitting bones on the ground, draw your belly in, and body reaching forward and down. Four, and five, just what in, hang your head up, stay there, and exhale. Pancha, inhale, come up, hands on your hips, and exhale. Good. Now we're gonna do the same with the hands on the on the waist. Okay. So you come inhale, open your arms. Do it. Exhale. Bring your hands again over the waist. Inhale again. And exhale. Now using the hips rotation, bring your body down. Whatever you can. Even here is absolutely fine. Bring your elbows back. 
shoulders down and break one now whatever you can keep leaning forward and down two whatever you can three elbows back four and uh, five chat body inhale bring your body up and exhale good now let's cross the arms back for uh, variation c so if i'm inhale open your arms do it exhale rotate your shoulders forward grab your elbows behind your back now literally speaking grab them with your hands okay now draw your belly in again three knee exhale fold down whatever you can again even here is fine and breathe one draw your belly in long strong legs two three Lower it down whatever you can three bring the shoulders away four long deep breaths and five now use the muscles in your bandhas and your legs chatwari inhale come up and say that exhale good let's do the last one come inhale bring your hands by your waist do it, exhale, grab the bitters, inhale again, three knee exhale, you can either stay there or gently start bending your elbows, whatever you can, remember toes up, feet pointing up, and breathe, one, whatever you can, slowly, slowly, slowly lower down, two, three now keep bringing space in between your shoulders okay four and five chatwari inhale halfway straight your arms and look forward now stay there draw your belly in and exhale good inhale come up hands on the waist and exhale release down Good, now we're gonna do Pajvottanasana. Now Pajvottanasana. Let's cross the legs and bring your right shin forward, okay? So we cross the leg with the right leg forward, okay? So engage your body. E, come inhale, open your arms. Do it, exhale, rotate your shoulders and bring your hands back. Now you can either make a prayer behind your back or again, rub your elbows, okay? Whatever is fine. Keep rotating your shoulders forward, press them down. Now do it, exhale, whatever you can, fold forward and breathe. One, two, draw your belly in. You can either go down if you want even more. Three, keep pressing your hips on the ground. Four, draw your belly in. And five, three, knee. inhale, come up. Good, now release and change the cross of your legs. Okay, so your left one is gonna be forward. Now again, either grab your elbows or pray your position behind your back. Inhale again. Exhale down. Keep breathing. One, two, shoulders away from your ears. Three, long deep breaths. Four, and five, fun time. come on. Beautiful exhale. Sounds like it here. Good. So now, guys, I would say that we're going to start the seated posture of the primary series. We're going to do a few asana there, and then we're going to close uh, the practice from, for today, okay? So now I'm going to turn again towards the front of the mat, so you can do exactly the same if you want. So we're going to start with the uh, dandasana position, right? So we're gonna bring the legs together, we're gonna bring the toes up, we're gonna bring the hands on the side. Now again, your shoulders, they are pointing forward. Now what we're doing is that we are lifting up from the chest, we are bringing the chin down and we breathe. One, now strong legs, engage your bandas, two, draw your belly in, three, feel your legs shaking and burning, keep lifting up, four, and five ashto inhale grab your toes in front of you now you can either stay there and inhale again 
Exhale, Nava, stay there, or lower down gently, whatever you can, it's fine. One. Just uh, engage your belly, engage your bandage to feel that the movement comes from the hips. Okay? Four. And the five. Inhale, show your arms and say that. Exhale. Now let's just do some drills here, okay? So cross your legs, bring your hands on your side, squeeze the knees on your chest and breathe. One, point your feet, two, so squeeze, three, squeeze again, four, and five. Now we only lift and we lower down again, we don't jump back, okay? So dasha inhale, we're gonna stay there, okay? So dasha inhale, lift, and breathe. One, hips gently back. Two, and three. Exhale down. Beautiful. Now, let's try to do an opening, a back bend for poor Vatanasana. We're gonna modify that one. So bring your hands back, okay? So press uh, the heel of your hand down on the floor. Now, shoulders forward, okay? So shoulders forward. Now draw your belly in, press down, press, point your feet, okay? Reach away from you. And what we are going to do is that we lift the chest, okay? So remember, your shoulders are forward. They are not pressing back. They are forward and you are opening up from the chest. Now you can either stay there with your head or you can bring it back, okay? So, squeeze the thighs together, one, draw your belly in, two, keep lifting up from your chest, three, four, and five, now exhale gently, uh, release, we're going to do the drill again, so cross your legs, squeeze the legs towards your chest, okay, bring your hands on the side and breathe, one, to feel the fire coming up inside of your body, right? Now you want to feel again the muscles engaging. Three, keep breathing. Four, the shaking of your body. Keep engaging your bandas. And five, that's inhale, lift up. And breathe. One. Again, two. Another one. Three. Exhale down. Now let's go directly in Navasana. So from here, lift your feet up. Bring your hands by your side. Lift your chest and breathe. One, two, three. Now remember, you can even bring your toes on the ground, okay? If it's this too much, but squeeze everything together. Four, and five. Cross your legs and push up. Inhale. Good, Sapta again, up, one, keep lifting up, two, your chest up gently, three, draw your belly down, four, and five, cross and push up, inhale, again, exhale, Sapta, one, squeeze your knees together, two, three, four, and five, cross, ash, so inhale, again, two more, one, two, keep squeezing, three, keep feeling the burning sensation, the fire inside of your body, maybe this word also, four, and five, ash, so inhale, exhale, last one, one, keep squeezing, two, your feet are down on the floor, hug your knees and shake. Well done everyone. Good. Beautiful. Now we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna stay a few breaths in uh, Sarvangasana shoulder stand, right, before we are finishing the practice. So you're gonna come a little forward, 
You're gonna lay down on your back. Straight your legs down, bring your hands on the ground. Huh? So now rotate your shoulders again forward and ashto, inhale, whatever you can, you come up. Now you can either stay here if you want, uh, but keep pointing your feet up, okay? You press the hands on the ground or lift up. And breathe. One. Two. Now remember in Sarvangasana, bring the thighs rotating towards one each other. Three, lift up. Press your shoulders on the ground, but keep rotating them forward, okay? Four, your drift is in the direction of the nose. And five, now exhale slowly, slowly roll down, okay? Good, beautiful. Now come up, seated position again. We are gonna do the drill. Right? So squeeze the legs towards your chest and press your hands on the ground. One, two, three, four, squeeze, and five. Now we're gonna stay up three breaths. So cross your legs again. Now if you want to bring your toes on the ground, that's absolutely fine. Bring your hands down. Now bring your hips up and back. One, shoulders forward, two, squeeze the pelvis, and three. Beautiful, exhale down, good. Now I'm going to turn myself again in front of you because we're gonna do the last three postures, okay? Now here, you can either take Padmasana position or cross your legs, okay? Now if you take Padmasana, uh, pass the right leg first and then your left one. Okay? Otherwise, just cross your legs as you prefer. Now rotate your shoulders forward for Bada Padmasana. Bring the hands back, either grabbing your elbows or brushing your hand on the side of your waist. Now, Nava exhale, fall down for Yoga Mudra, whatever you can. And breathe. Now you want to reach forward and you can either bring the forehead on the round or your chin. One. Now keep bringing your elbows together. Two. I'm gonna show you from the side. Three. Keep breathing deeply. In and now let the sitting bones rise in gently. Three again. Four. Keep squeezing the pelvis floor, your bandas. And five, dasha, inhale, lift up. And we take Padmasana. So we're gonna bring the top of the hands on the knees, thumb and index together, engage your arms, draw your belly in. Now chest up, chin down. Take a deep breath in. And a deep breath out. Squeeze the bandas. Again, in. And out. Deeply in. And out. Again, in, keep squeezing the bandas, lift your spine up, and out. Last one, in, and out. Good, beautiful. Let's do Ut Plute here. Okay? So everyone, I want you to take your hands on your side and whatever crossing position you are, you're going to lift your body up. So if you are in Padmasana, lift up, lift your knees and breathe. One. If you are crossing your legs, just bring your toes on the ground 
and you want to bring your hips to okay three four keep breathing long deep breaths and five exhale down now release your legs in front of you well done everyone and uh, we are just simply laying down on the back for uh, our rest okay we're gonna take a few moments here so we are literally speaking resting all right so we're not doing anything bring your attention to the breath and just rest your body and your mind well done well done everyone Now, slowly, slowly, bring your attention back to your physical body and bring movements in there, fingers, toes, maybe your feet, your arms, your head. Now, slowly and gently, bring your legs together and your knees by your chest, give it a little squeeze and a little massage. Keep observing your breath, your eyes are closed. And with the next exhalation, walk down on your right and lift up. Take a seated position of your choice. Remember, close your eyes. Bring your hands over your knees. Lift your spine up and release your shoulders down. Close your eyes, tuck your chin under gently, bring space in your neck area. And release your breath. Bring your attention there in your breath. And engage back with your body. Feel the energy of the practice, the aliveness of your body after the practice. Observe the air coming in and the air going out. Gently bring the hands together in front of your heart. Press your hands together. Feel the sensation of your hands touching. Feel the sensation of warmth, the vibrations, the weight of your arms, of your hands. Maybe your hands are touching your chest and feel the touch. Expand your chest with the inhalation and release it down with the exhalation. And we finish the practice with the OM sound. So I want you to experience and observe the vibration of the sound inside of your ears and the vibration of the sound inside of your body and in your cavities, it can be in your throat, it can be in your chest. So take a deep breath in.
good. Thank you. Namaste. Thank you. Beautiful. So I hope that you like this class here. If you like it, just use it whenever you want. And I will see you next time. So have a beautiful day. Bye-bye, everyone. Thank you so much. Namaste.